Hello my lovelies, welcome back to my channel and happy new year. I hope you guys had a lovely Christmas and new year um, and looking forward to everything that's going to happen in 2019. Um, so I thought I would do a what I got for Christmas but just of all my Disney things. There was quite a bit, I was a little bit spoiled this year I've got to admit. Um, you know, as a disclaimer, I am not bragging or things like that. I just wanted to show you guys and then hopefully you guys might be able to pick some of these things up in the sale. So... It's a bit all over the shop, as per usual. Um, I thought I would start with my Funko Pops because this is a collection that Chris and I have recently started and it's got out of control already, so that's a good start. So Chris got me Boo, Sully, Roz, because Chris always says that I remind him of Roz. I don't know how to take that, but there we are. Um, he got me Cusco. He got me Apprentice Mickey and he also got me Oogie Boogie. If you've been watching my Instagram stories, you guys know how much I wanted Oogie Boogie. So I was really, really glad that he got me him. Um, I also do have the Chef from Monsters Inc. as I do the Pop in the Box munch uh, munchy monthly subscriptions. Um, so I also have the Chef, so I now have the complete Monsters Inc. collection. So that was all my pops. Um, everything else is just a bit all over the shop. So one of the things that my mum got me was this giant pua. And he is adorable. I think Chris loves him a lot more than I thought he would as well, which is always good. Um, so my mum got me him. I think he was from the Disney Store sale when they went down to £25, I think. And I think some of them are still in the sale right now. So I'm going to pop him just up there. He's kind of in the shot. <laughs> Um, so something else was from my Secret Santa, they got me this uh, Minnie Mouse microwavable warmer. So you just pop her in the microwave and then she's like a really nice little cosy warmer. This I think is from Debenhams, I'm sure I've seen it in there at some point. Um, next off are two gifts from my friend Penny. She got me these face masks. Now you guys, if you see my Instagram you know that I did the aerial face mask which was hysterical for us all. So she got me the villains ones, so you've got Cruella, Maleficent and Ursula. I'm really, really looking forward to putting these on. I'm pretty sure that these are from Boots, I have seen them in there. And then something else she got me was a makeup headband, and when you pop it on you've got little Minnie Mouse ears. I have no idea where this is from though, I'm afraid. Um, something else is from another friend in work, my friend Dexter. He got me this Mickey Mouse and it is the one where he's, I think is it Robin Hood he's dressed like? But yeah, he got me that one. Um, I'm pretty sure that this is from HMV. Then Chris found these marvellous Nightmare Before Christmas mystery boxes. And I absolutely love mystery boxes and things. Like, they really amuse me. Like, he got me a few of the um, Harry Potter ones as well. So, I opened up this one. And I have this little guy. Look how cute he looks. I think, is this Barrel? I think it's Barrel. Um, and then he got me two, so he got me that one. I opened up another one and I had the mayor, but I don't know where I've put him. <laughs> um, let me see if Jesse, if he's in here. No, he's not. He might turn up at some point. Something else that Chris also got me was the set of up makeup bags. Now, Chris, like hands down to him, he was brilliant. He saw everything that I started to put on my Instagram story for my Disney page and started to collect bits and bobs as, as I went along and did that. So I've got the up. Um, makeup bag, travel storage thing. Then he also got me, and I'm in love with this as well, the Danielle Nicole Little Mermaid one. Um, I think both of these were from Shop Disney, but this is just stunning. And you've got three different bags in there as well. Um, oh, look, there's the mayor. There he is. He was in there somewhere. Um, Chris also got me this little Pua storage. Now I'm thinking of unzipping him and keeping this open and then putting makeup brushes in there or maybe my um, beauty blenders in there. And he's just really, really sweet. He's also from Shop Disney. Then my friend Emma got me this Dumbo keyring. Now this is really, really lovely. I'm actually going to put him on my lanyard in work so I could have him everywhere I go in work. Um, Chris also did more mystery boxes, um, he did the Funko Disney Princess ones and in there I got Ariel and I got Elsa. Um, when we went into Forbidden Planet when we were Christmas shopping I saw these Stitch mystery bags and I fell in love with them. I bought one for myself and I got the Elvis Stitch and I didn't know that Chris picked one up for me as well and it's this little guy right here. Look how adorable he is, even with his angry face he's really really cute. Something else that Chris picked up, 
so he got me all three different hair masks um, I'm pretty sure that these are from Shop Disney but you can also find them in Debenhams and I think John Lewis I might be wrong I don't know so he got me all three of the princess hair masks and I'm really really excited to try these out then he got me some pins to go in my collection so these are the new Shop Disney pins so he got me the one if I can turn it around that says Mickey on there I don't know if you guys can see that then he also got me the scar one that says I'm surrounded by idiots and I'm sure everyone can agree that there has been a time when you've just gone and made the face that scar makes um, and then he got me this one which I absolutely love this is the Walt Disney whoops, Walt Disney Pictures one I don't know if you guys can see this one turn around can you guys see that and I absolutely love this pin something else he also got me was the lip balm now this was in Debenhams and it was in Shop Disney now one thing which I didn't expect at all and I remember mentioning it once in the airport on the way to um, Disneyland Paris was this handbag from Skinny Dip look at this I'm absolutely in love with it I just open it up there you've got two separate compartments as well and then it just sort of clips shut like that but I am in love with this bag I cannot wait to wear it when we go out somewhere he also got me the Nightmare Before Christmas wash bag I love this, it's adorable um, I love having wash bags because like, I fill them up with different things so they're ready to go whenever we go on holiday um, he also got me this aerial scarf which is from EMP I don't know if you guys can see there it's got tentacles and shells and somewhere there we go you've got Ariel so if you're wondering why there's so many things Chris and I um, we get presents for each other and we also have a stocking so all these little things were in my stocking I also have two of the Funko pens are they Funko? I'm not sure but I have two of these pens I've got the Robin Hood one and the marching band one um, these I think were from HMV or they might have been from Forbidden Planet I'm not sure and then he also got me this new phone case um, if you guys have seen my phone my case is really starting to um, fall apart on me so I'm really really glad to have this one and I absolutely loved the face that is on this I really loved him with his angry face I don't know why so I'm going to pop that on after this video um, he also got me one of the pens with the interchangeable inks in the Lion King and then another set of mystery things he um, did the figural mystery bags from the Disney store and I had Oogie Boogie which I'm really really happy about and I also had Lumiere which is lovely because I have Mrs Potts so now I've got Lumiere to go with it um, what's next, what's next, what's next Ooh, I also had, sorry about the rest of them, I'm trying to get them out of the bag I had two notebooks, these are both from Shop Disney, I had this really gorgeous stitch one and it's lovely and glittery and you've got little stitches on the inside as well and then I also have one of the DVD, of uh, the DVD, the video um, ones, the VHS ones which and I had the Lion King one from Chris, I absolutely love these when they came out, I was really really hoping I'd get one for Christmas and then you've just got Simba and Nala in the corner um, something that my mother-in-law got me, in fact two things that my mother-in-law got me was this metal sign from Alice in Wonderland so again as you guys have probably heard I am trying to sort out a new background for, our, for my videos so this will look lovely on the wall also got me hidden at the bottom of here was the Alice in Wonderland tote bag right by there now there's another bag by here and some of the figurines so I'll leave the figurines until last so something that my mum got me was this gorgeous Alice in Wonderland set from Wittards. Um, I saw this when we went to Winchester and I fell in love with it and I actually didn't expect my mum to get it and she did without me knowing. I'll just open it up for you. So you've got biscuits and tea and a mug in there. I just think this set is absolutely lovely and I'm, I'm just so happy that I had it and so grateful that my mum got it for me. Um, so something else oh Chris popped these in my stocking this is a Disney card game and um, we have already played this it was really fun these are from Marks and Spencers um, it just has a load of trivia questions on there and of course I won <laughs> 
Um, something that my mum got me was a Minnie Mouse nail file from Primark and the Alice in Wonderland hairbrush. Now my mum thought that I already had one of these and just got me it anyway but I actually don't own this so I'm really really happy that she got it for me. Um, oh she also got me this Mickey Mouse hat. How adorable is this? I really hope we get some snow so I can wear it out because it's just so cute. Um, something that my nan got me was this diary and it's really really lovely. I absolutely love Winnie the Pooh. It's just a really really lovely diary. I don't actually know where this is from I'm afraid. Um, something that my nan also got me was this gorgeous Alice in Wonderland mug. Now I know that this was from Clinton Cards. And then, oh it's still in its packaging so excuse me a minute. This gorgeous Alice in Wonderland bag. My mum bought me this. Um, you can get it in Disneyland Paris, but I think she ordered it off the Shop Disney website. And it is absolutely stunning. Um, so, the wonderful company Ears Ever After, um, I will link their Instagram below, did a Secret Santa and I joined in. So, I have my Secret Santa present. So, this was from, and I apologise if I get this wrong, her, her name's Laura. But her username for Instagram is at L underscore um, Broadhead. I will also leave her linked in the description box. So she wrote me this really lovely card. And she also got me this lovely little Ursula figure. Um, the, lovely, the Cheshire Cat shower cap, which I'm in love with. So I can't wait to use that. And then she also got me this really lovely sign that's got my name on it. It does remind me a little bit of Tigger. So this can also go on the wall um, to make my new YouTube background. So on to the final few things. So Chris got me the Villains book collection. I'm so excited. I've seen so many people reading these. So I can't wait to get stuck into them. Hopefully after once I've done all my coursework, I can start reading them. Um, Chris bought me two games. He bought me the Disney Song Challenge, which I cannot wait to play, and I think this deserves a YouTube video. So I'm wondering if either Chris or my friend Jess, um, who has a Disney Instagram called Jessie in Neverland, will join me in a game of this. And then something else that Chris got me was this. I've, I've never seen this before. Like, I've seen I think, once, and it was in America, so I was like, well, I'm never going to be able to get it. But it is this Disney Villains game. He did have this shit from America and I was just over the moon when I opened up this. I'm so, so, so excited to play it. I think you can play as the different villains, so you can get, like, the Queen of Hearts, which, you know, Alice in Wonderland, my favourite. So I'm really looking forward to playing this. Um, I'm not sure where it's from. I think it's from Amazon, but I could be completely wrong about that. Um, if I find it, I will link it below in the description box. So, on to the final few things. Um, figurines and things like that. So my uncle bought me the Moana Tradition really really love and you've got a little poo over there. Chris brought me this gorgeous um, Mickey and Minnie snow globe. This is from Clinton Cars as well. You've got glitter in there and then when you wind up it plays the Mickey Mouse March. Um, oh something else that Chris bought was this um, Nutcracker in the Four Realms mug from Shop Disney. I still haven't seen the film yet but the Nutcracker is my favourite ballet so I am looking forward to watching that and having a nice little hot chocolate in this. Um, two more things. My nan very kindly brought me the tradition of lock, shock and barrel. I absolutely love this. Um, when I unwrapped up my grandparents, my granddad had no idea what this was from. So I actually put the YouTube video up on the telly for them. And I, I showed him the video, um, the kidnap the Santa Claus, Sandy Claus video. And um, he still had no idea why on earth I wanted this, but I am in love with it. Um, it's just got so much detail on it and it's a lot bigger than it looks in the pictures. And then the final thing, this is from Clinton Cars, this was off my mum, is this Cheshire Cat money box. And he's he's a lot bigger than I thought he was as well. And I'm looking forward to saving all our pennies up for our honeymoon in there. And I think that is everything. So thank you guys so much for watching. As always, please like and subscribe and comment down below if you've got any videos uh, video ideas for me. See you soon guys. Bye!